First question will go to Michael Roberson. Michael, go ahead. All right, Spencer, 17 points, five threes, uh, really did a great job today. And despite Oscar not having the best game uh, this time, how much did you feel was on you to kind of take the lead tonight? Uh, I kind of felt it was just coming, really just coming after the Colorado game. I didn't think I was aggressive enough, really looking for my shots and the coaches let me know that. So, you know, coming out tonight, I knew I was gonna, I was gonna have to get them up and I, hey, they went in. So it's always, always good when that happens. Next, we'll go over to Grant Avalon. Grant, go ahead. There were long stretches of this game where Utah was unable to get really any good looks. Can you talk about, you know, the adjustments you were able to make on defense and also the value of getting guys like Bryce and Dejon back out there? Uh, yeah, that was pretty much the adjustment. I mean, you know, when you have, you know, we have guys like me, B, Day, Zaire, all uber athletic guys who really commit to the defensive end. I mean, our defensive potential is sky, like just skyrocket. So having them out there, I mean, I feel like we can shut down just about anybody. And you know, a lot of guys have stepped into, you know, bigger roles with all of the injuries and un unavailabilities. And now with everyone coming back, you know, can you talk about how better prepared this team is because of those experiences? I feel like, you know, we definitely have a lot more leadership now having Day and Day and Bryce and really help us, you know, stay together, you know, you know, because, you know, basketball is a game of runs and you got to stay together. So having them, having their presence there really helps us. And then, you know, just have whether they're coming off the bench or staying in. I mean, we have plenty of just talented guys to give us energy boost, talent boost, to, you know, just go out there and compete. Thank you. Next, we'll go to Jacob Rayburn. Jacob, go ahead. Hey, Spencer. Um, I'm curious about something that's been talked about a, a little bit around the program, which is when Dejan, Zaire, and Bryce went down, the remaining guys became a really strong unit. You guys were playing really well together. Um, is there something to the idea that when the other guys come back, it, you also have to kind of restart the cohesion process because it's, it's a bit of a different looking group at that point? I don't think we had to really restart the cohesion. I mean, I felt like, you know, we knew our strengths at that time. And I mean, it was us against the world. So we knew we were just really going to have to battle with all the little things, the 50-50 balls, the boxing out. And we really, I feel like through that stretch, we really almost perfected that. And so we were just we were just playing just real grit, tough ball, you know, that Coach Ass has just been trying to implement, a, implement in us ever since, you know, each of, each of us got here. Thanks. Next, we'll go back to Michael Roberson. Go ahead, Michael. Spencer, how, how much of it is being back in the friendly confines of Maples that you got your stroke back like you did tonight? I mean, you know, I put thousands of thousands of shot up shots up in this gym. So, I mean, I'm definitely comfortable being back in here. Um, I mean, shoot, it's it's always great to it's always great to come back come back home. I mean, you know, as a shooter, you know, you just you, like I said, you're just used to the rims. And when one goes in, you just build that confidence, and you hear you know hear the announcer calling your name and the guys cheering. So it's always it's always great to shoot at home. Next, we'll go to Gavin McDonald. Gavin, go ahead. Yeah, talking about that great shooting tonight. Um, do you think the your effort on the defensive end field the five for nine three point shooting? Um, I mean, I'm always trying to I'm always trying to do my best in the defensive end. I mean, you know, we're a defensive minded team, and you know, past few games I've been on, you know, either the best or second best players. So it's if I'm stopping them, yeah, it does it does fuel my offense a little bit. But also, if, you know, if they make they make a couple buckets, it's also an extra incentive to go you know go get those back on the other end. Anything else tonight for Spencer? All right, Spencer, thanks for the time. Congrats on the win. Thank you very much. I appreciate all you.